A storm outbreak is offering farmers a much-needed reprieve from drought conditions, meanwhile, in central and southern Queensland. Lauren Forbes joins us live from the Gold Coast. Lauren, finally, a bit of rainfall after this record dry spell. How much will it help? Well, Tom, Queensland uh, saw its driest August to October spell on record of just 10 millimetres of rain on average across the state. Now, those conditions combined with gusty winds fanned dozens of early season bushfires across the state and put a number of crops under threat. But thankfully, this wet weather uh, has returned this month with an abundance of thunderstorms, dampening those drought concerns for farmers. A number of... And parts of southern and inland Queensland saw more rain in the past week than the entirety of the last three months. Now more storms are on the cards for today and tomorrow in southern parts of Queensland which also could spark a number of fresh fires and there are early signs that this wet weather could persist till early next week but conditions are likely to get dry and hot again as El Nino persists. Tom?